Hello, welcome back to Outside Xbox. I'm Mike here with Andy. Hello. And we are playing the Resident Evil 7 demo, the Midnight Update, which is the last of the updates to the Resident Evil 7 demo. Why uh, do they keep updating it, Mike? Can't they just leave it alone? Uh, well... Can't they just lock it in a box and chain it up and throw it into the bottom of a lake? Uh, maybe at the end of this uh, Let's Play, you will be you will be feeling like that. It's the only way to stop the horror coming <laughs> back, Mike. <laughs> so this is stuff from the kitchen demo. This yep. videotape. Now I remember it doesn't end well for these guys. <laughs> <laughs> I get the feeling it's not going to end well for anyone involved in this game. Yeah. It's a good thing you found that big knife. Yeah, but look how bad he is at cutting ropes. <laughs> it's just wow. He's not helping himself. No, not really. So this is like a modified version of Beginning Hour with extra stuff in it, right? So, I mean, there was um, already a lot of stuff in there. Yeah, so they've already updated it once with the Twilight update, and this yeah. is the Midnight update. <laughs> this is the final one. Is it just more mannequins? Right, um, let's investigate. I should, yep. Again, I, he still wants to dash them against <laughs> the stones. That's not changed. So this stuff is, as as you will remember from the existing demo, mm. um, if we don't, don't move, they can't come and get us. Why? Ooh. You know that happens and it's scary. <laughs> <laughs> it's just to warm it. It's just to get your nerves on edge, Andy, okay, and then we'll we'll get to the real horror. So we kind of know about the, the fireplace and all that stuff. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. So, yeah, yeah. Um, there they are, the spooky. lovely family. <laughs> spooky family. Mm. My advice is to get out of the house, like the thing said. All right. Okay. I duly noted. I mean, I get that you love this room, I can yeah. see, and I can see why. I just don't want to go anywhere. No. Well, I mean, if I remember the last demo, you don't see anyone for a little bit. Yeah. So we're safe. But this is an updated sound. version, so who knows what we might see. Well. We've got to be on edge. Okay, I am on edge now. <laughs> uh, if you did miss the uh, the first demo, you can watch Luke and Ellen playing it over on outside, oh, outside extra, extra yeah. and dealing with it probably about as well as I I did. <laughs> so you see that scary mouldy door? Yes, I remember you it. You well. couldn't go through that in the previous version of the demo. No, or but like you weren't allowed down into the basement. But now you are allowed down into the. Basement. You're allowed down into the basement. Yeah, and. You know, in horror movies, what generally happens when you go down to the basement is lovely things. Yep. <laughs> you find a haunted music box. Yeah. Or uh, there's like a witch flying around that yeah. you need to chainsaw <laughs> up. Generally. All right. Let's get this fuse in this uh, Fine. In this box. Because we've had a bit of a scout around. and um, You know, it's, uh, it's look, the coast is looking clear for now. So here we go. Pull the handle. There you go. And then, where was that? Secret panel thing that pops out. It's there. There we go. There, there we go. Is. Secret panel. Good stuff. Okay. Safe this forever in the walls. Yeah, look. And there's the fuse. We could just live in the walls like a rat person. Mm. Yeah, and then we could scare them. Yeah, exactly. Scare yeah. the family by hiding in the walls. There we go. Good. Fuse in All there. All green. green. Easiest Resident Evil puzzle ever, I think, probably. Yeah, it should have been a uh, knight crest that you had to <laughs> yeah. put in the fuse box. As I understand it, this game is full of that sort of thing. Oh, really? It just none of it's in the demo. Oh, okay. So. Fair. Anyway, that light's on that button now, so yeah. we can probably press that. Oh, oh good. Oh, it's the, the mannequin. The mannequin attic. I remember <laughs> it well. It's your favourite place. Hit the button. Stop putting your face so close to things. <laughs> I like to put my face close to things oh, in horror really? games. I'm, I'm ready for the mannequin jump scare. Okay. Yeah. What mannequin jump scare? Oh. Have they... Oh, you can't remove jump scares. <laughs> How is removing jump scares scary? I don't. Well, get because you were all tensed up and ready, and then oh, no, you won't happen. be tensed up. You'll be relaxed oh. for the next jump scare. This place is just like attics upon attics, isn't it? Yeah, that's. How is it all attic? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. This house is ninety percent attic. Yeah, seven layers of attic. No, oh, just groping the door jam there. Yeah, wait, like wait a for the door, Mike. There's a phone here, which I'm sure will work. Yeah, just dial. Perfectly. Hello, police. I'm in an attic. Oh. I would like to report an attic crime. They haven't been paying their phone bills, clearly. They can't. <laughs> They're too busy murderizing Murdering. people. Uh, are they watching us from the helicopter? <gasps> Look. Is that a star's helicopter? It's an, uh, yeah. Well, it had the like umbrella logo on oh, it, Oh, okay. It? The umbrella logo. Yeah. yeah. So I think it's interesting that it does still tie into the kind of resi fiction a bit. Presumably mannequins. they run a mannequin factory. There we go. Basement key. So yeah, I think this is new. Yeah, so oh, yeah. there's uh, a, a window which looks like it might be an escape, maybe. Yeah, look at that. Those glorious god rays leading us to freedom. Shall I, uh, shall I climb up the, yeah, to the window, yeah, why not? Leave, leaving my back exposed to the rest of the room? It's, Mike, stop saying ominous things. <laughs> all right, turn, a, turn around. Okay, all right. No, turn around. I need to get... Oh, I can't go down the ladder backwards. 
Uh, we're okay. Okay, fine. Just, just mannequin butts. Downstairs God rays. <laughs> well, we've got the basement key now. Okay. Which is progress of I a don't, sort. I don't feel like there will be a way out through the basement, though. But uh, y- there might be clues, vital clues, Andy, mm. as to what the hell's going on in here. Mm. I don't, what clues. I don't want to know what's <laughs> going on in here. I don't want any more information. <laughs> Should we go in the kitchen? No. All right. Go in the basement. All right, That's all right. We have a key. I'm just having a look in the kitchen to check there's no one doing anything gross in there. I think the coast is clear in the kitchen. Yes, so don't go Mostly. in. All right, all right, all right, all right. Could all right. be full of uh, zombie chefs. All right, well, we'll go to the basement via that really gross-looking mouldy door, which is probably yeah. totally fine. So it's so mouldy, you could just kick that off the hinges, I reckon. Oh, that's all right. This one's not the locked door. Oh. I, I just touched it. I just, oh, I'm just touching the gross touching mold. The mold. <laughs> right, okay. Mm. All right. Spooky creaking. Uh, a disgusting toilet. Yeah. Horror game toilets are the absolute worst. Yeah. The, oh. Sweet hand- handgun ammo. But no handgun. Just no. can you throw the bullets? <laughs> really hard. As hard as you can. <laughs> why Why is someone's parked their bicycle in the bar? Yeah. Uh, okay. Looks like we could fit something into that pipe. You get back from a vigorous cycle <laughs> and you need a, a bath. You just cycle <laughs> straight into the bathroom. All right. Well, we've got some handgun bullets. A handgun would be would be very much appreciated right now. What's in here? Blank, Blank notebook. notebook. That's not a handgun. You could write down your thoughts about <laughs> what's going on. Some poetry, maybe. A haiku. This house is scary. It is full of mannequins. I don't like it much. <laughs> there you go. Excellent on the fly ha- haiku, though. Thanks. We've got the basement key. I've, I've moved into a tactical crouch. And we're going we're gonna to unlock this door. Oh. Oh. Here we go. Oh. Push it open. Oh. It's very dark in this basement. Look Mike. how deep this basement is. It's, is it's it, absolutely huge. Is it going to be basements on basements? Yeah, like there's attics on pretty attics. Pretty much. There's yeah. one normal level of house, <laughs> and then it's six floors in either direction. <laughs> Boiler there. Boiler. You can figure out why all the bathtubs are filling up with blood. Yeah. Here's your problem. Boiler's <laughs> full of blood. <laughs> okay, I pause to have a sip of tea here. It's right. cost you. <laughs> Won't be cheap. Okay. Oh, oh. What was that sound? Uh, it's probably fine. Uh, we could just l- leave or we can go through. It sounded like a fat monster. Oh, there's bodies. Oh. Oh, there's bodies. Oh, oh look. Ugh. Don't touch them. <laughs> what the? <laughs> what's doing? the matter with you? Look, <laughs> <some kick. laughs> what the hell are you doing? You can kick the bodies. Look. What? Yeah, well, don't, though. <laughs> oh, man. All right. Oh, look, valve handle. I wonder oh, if that fits in that bathroom that we were just in. Yeah, yeah. We should go back and leave this murder basement immediately mm. no i said please creepy doll look yeah no why don't we go further into the murder basement oh god sounds sounds, <laughs> sounds. <laughs> why what the hell was that uh ah uh, what is, oh god <laughs> hit it with the valve handle <laughs> resist oh it bit me yes resist is a good idea okay, okay get uh, out get out <laughs> oh my god where's my door oh my god mike i swear to god kick a corpse into it <laughs> open the door uh, i'm trying to stop being tra- oh my god Who's he? <laughs> Don't know, but he's why? Seems keen for us to be inside with the with the murder monster. Well, d- all right, I'm circle the, strafe. I'm, I'm kicking the corpse. At circle it. strafe. This seems to be working Is fine. It? Yeah, really? I think I've knocked him out. Look, he's on the floor. And again, one more time. Kick. What? Oh, oh no, he's he, no. He's wise to my plan. Oh, yes, you are dead. <laughs> Correct. Okay. Well. All right. We'll have another crack. Yourself that. to blame, Mike. Okay, we're back in the basement. What went wrong last time? We got ate, eaten by a monster. Yes, that was correct. the main thing that went wrong. I'm glad but we've got a solid strategy in that we can kick the corpse into it. Is him that and he really does fall over. a solid strategy? I mean, it's the best I've got right now. Is there another way out? Uh, well, I think probably what we need to do is when that guy's <laughs> buggered off on that door, yeah. we have another crack at getting out there because I don't think there's any other way out of the out of the basement. But is he just going to leave it unlocked? Um. Yeah, I, I would have thought so, yeah, yeah. Or maybe he's, like, blocking it off or something. Okay, got the valve handle. Now Now just go out the door. Should we just go out the door? Yeah. yeah. Right, okay. No? No. Oh, there he is. You again. Oh, but where's the monster? Oh, you're the worst. All right, well... Oh, the monster's Oh, the monster's right there. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> okay. Right, uh, get... Mike! <laughs> Mike! Oh, he's bit... Oh, he's bit me again. Absolute gear. Right, now kick things... I'm trying... I'm, oh. Look, I, oh, it needs another one. Where's the there you go. Okay. Right. Oh, okay. Nice. We're out. We're out. Yes. We're out. Okay. Good. I'm sprinting. I'm. I'm right. running Upstairs. away. 
can he follow you upstairs? Is he an upstairs monster? I don't think he's a bit like a Dalek. I don't think right. he can do you stairs. You can't climb stairs. Too complicated. Yeah. Okay. okay. That went better that time. Yeah. You did get bitten on the hand. So Does that oh. mean you become a zombie? Well, I guess I probably am infected, aren't I? Just whack that in. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that! Oh, look at that hand injury. That looks awful. Oh, wow. That's good. It's got like persistent damage on your character yeah. model. All right, should we flush the toilet? No way. Because there might be something useful in there, like or a handgun. Oh god. Okay. Well, that. And a bunch of syringes. That's luckier than I was expecting. <laughs> well, if I wasn't infected before, having plunged my hand into a toilet bowl full of syringes, I probably am now. You got two bullets. Yeah. Brilliant. I can reload and put them both in the in the in the gun. There you go. Excellent. Two right. whole bullets. Right, should we go down in the basement and shoot that guy? Yeah, let's go shoot that thing Twice directly in the face. In the head. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you've got to save one for you in case he gets you. Oh, well, that, that gives me one bullet. Oh. All right, okay. okay. Oh, look at my hand. Yeah, oh. I told you not to get bitten. Didn't oh, I? it's not looking good. It's not looking now good. Now you're all infected. Well, I'm ready. Come at me, monsters. I've got a gun now and I'm all yeah. full of confidence. It's going to be excellent. <laughs> Full of <laughs> confidence <laughs> and, and zombie virus. virus. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, look at my gun. PT didn't give you a gun, did it? No, that's really where it fell down. I felt. <laughs> <laughs> it should have just yeah. filled what's her face with bullets. Giving you a rocket launcher. <laughs> <laughs> where is it? Where are you? You absolute jerk hole. Yeah. Has he gone? Where are you? On your left? Oh, maybe. Oh, oh. Oh, no, no, in front of me. I didn't realise there was a thing there. Ah. Good. Uh, okay, right, those were my two both bullets. Your bullets. Well done. Help! Help me! Oh my! Oh, I'm being mauled again. Oh, I. All right. Um. Where? I feel like you're slightly overconfident with your two bullets. Yeah, there. I know. I know. Oh, is there something? Something What's around that? here. What is it? Um, I can't see anything. No. Oh. Oh. Now uh. we're trapped in this place. Well, that's not not so great. Uh, Good. Oh, oh my oh. gun. Oh my gun. Okay. So while I appreciate your plan of blocking yourself in a cupboard with a monster, yeah, I think it maybe wasn't the best. No, that's true. The best option there. But I feel like there's something in there that I need to grab. So I. So you're gonna go back. Yeah. But I think my strategy might be if I can just get the thing before I. Go like before I, I, I get it escape the first right. time. Can then I don't have to go back down. What I'm going to try and do is grab everything from that room before you know during the first encounter with that monster. Right. Um. So so that I don't have to go back down there because going back down there I think is just going to maximise the chances of me. Plus I'm going to use my corpse kicking technique, which I think works pretty well. Knocking actually. him over. Yeah, exactly. To buy me a bit of time. Okay. All right. So got the valve handle. Like, are you going in there yet, or are you going to wait? What's the quickest way to... I think just run... Surely just run in, right? Yeah, He's okay. going to come go from in. the left. So I'm going to go in. in. Now, wait. Oh. oh it's up on the, up on the right. Oh, He's going crazy. Gotcha. Up on the right. Attic window. Attic window. Okay. Great. Right, okay. Oh, oh, oh no, he's oh, here. Oh, but it. it's fine. We'll, let's just get yeah. out of here. Okay. Out, out, out. Okay, so I need to try the door once. And then that the guy guy's face is going to be there. Yeah. yeah, we get it. You're here. Uh, Very good. Okay, right. Okay. Corpse kicking time. Corpse kick. Corpse kick, special there we go. move. Bam! Nice. All right, now get out of here. Down like a sack of spuds. Okay, one, and then another. Need another. Come on, prompt. Kick it. There we go. Yes. Right, I'm through. Yes. He's hot on your heels. Oh. Oh, great. Okay. We're good. Sorted. We're right. Safe. Get, get the gun. Go get the handgun. And then uh, shoot your way out of the attic window. Dive out of the attic window, firing While the gun. Like Steve Burnside. Yep. Sideways. <laughs> oh. What? You didn't even get bitten. I or think I got, you? like, slashed. Oh. I didn't get properly chewed up. What? God damn it. All right. Yeah, I think I'm still infected, unfortunately. Oh, just look at that yeah. grossness. Do with the shower after this. Yeah, but the shower's full of blood, unfortunately. Yeah. Okay, flush the toilet. Maybe one of those syringes is the cure to my disease. <laughs> or a much worse disease. <laughs> yeah, probably. Hard to say. Well, I've got a handgun. At least. It's not going to be a very prolonged diving sideways firing bullets. No, got two of them. literally two bullets. But it'll still be good. <coughs> okay. Oh, oh, man, oh wow. I've got all the disease right now. I'm feeling super gross. Got all of the T-virus. Okay, it's through here, isn't it? Uh, God rays. Freedom. Yes. Freedom. Freedom, God rays. I've got the key. Right. Now, watch behind you. I can't go up backwards. Right. We'll just aim the gun behind you and fire <laughs> at <laughs> periodic intervals oh. to stop anything following you. 
Why oh. are you dying of T-virus? Oh. That's not helping. Why are my hands, they've gone entirely scabby. Yeah. Oh. Now you see what you did there was succumb to the T-virus oh. when you should have gone out the window. Yeah, it's a bit of a schoolboy error really, isn't it? Or you should have cut your hand off in the basement, like in Evil Dead 2. Oh yeah, farewell to arms. Yeah, put a bucket on it and a copy of farewell <laughs> to arms on top of that. Oh, it's this Whoa, guy. Shoot oh, him. Nothing. Just a man. Oh, man without a family. Shoot him in the crotch. This is not the time to rub in the fact that I don't have a family. Oh. All right. All right. Well, well, that was the new Resident Evil 7 demo. You got the infected ending. I know. I assume that's not the good ending. <laughs> no, exactly. It implies that maybe there's an ending where you aren't infected yes. and you don't end up dying. Although, quite frankly, I can't imagine it ends well for you either way. And maybe like, there was a cure in the kitchen. Maybe. I can't imagine it lets you climb out of the attic window, though, no, and you just true. go on to live a full and happy life. Doesn't seem like their sort of thing, really, <laughs> does it? No. All right. Well, that was us playing the Resident Evil 7. Uh, beginning our demo with the Midnight Update, which is out right now, as far as I know. Uh, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed this, and we'll see you next time. Bye.